Bonjour. Donc, uh, my name is uh, Guillaume Nicoli. Um, I introduce you the place of the machinery where we are doing all our products. Um, just to jump on some, actually, the products we are doing, we are pretty known for the macarons. This is not the only one we do. This is actually something I wanted to introduce in New Zealand when we set up the business a couple of years ago. Um, let me show you then macaron. It's an un unlimited creativity product. For example, here, now we want to work on uh, some marble uh, color. So you can see here on each shell, which is they've been piping by hand, one by one. Those ones are already cooked, ready to stuff. We have each of them having the marble and then we can play all around and having some different colorways. I have the chance to work with a really good chef, which is Michael Meredith. Um, he asked me to create some new flavor of macarons for his degustation menu. And the good thing is he gave me some challenge all the time. The first challenge was a, a macaron with beetroot, tarragon, and strawberry. And the second challenge he gave me is actually a seaweed macaron, which is, he still have on his menu at the moment. So this is to say that with this product we can all the time play around and all the time create something different. Um, so you can actually think that now regarding the macarons, we are doing um, approximately 1,600 per day. And as you see, everything is made by hand. Um, each shell being piped manually also. Cook it, well of course dry it before, and then cook it, and then as you see, we stuff them by hand and close them by hand. Um, this is what is the macaron. It's actually um, a really long process pastries. And now, uh, after this one, um, to get, as you can see right now, the, the shell is a little bit dry in the middle. It's a little bit dry now. So actually, what is the, what is the, the matter of the macaron is, after stuffing, we're going to keep them in the fridge 24 hours to make the ganache, which is the, stuff, the stuffing and the shell, having a fusion. This is why this texture is really enjoyable after it. You got this little crunch, and then the gooish, and finally you keep the cream uh, for the stuffing. What I would like to, to really, really have an achievement will be to, to make people understand that machinery we are making some quality and we are making these high-standing pastries as have been